I'm Svetlana Mincheva, and I'm director of programs at the National Coalition Against Censorship in the United States. So national sounds like the, the world's coalition, but we're U.S.-based, and we work in the U.S. Uh, I'm here today because I'm speaking as part of the All That Is Banned Is Desired conference, and I've been speaking on a panel about religion and free speech. Uh, this is the first conference that actually focuses on artistic freedom issues. Uh, it's really a wonderful moment for me because I've been interested in taking my work, which uh, has been focused in the U.S., to a kind of international stage and meeting others that work on artistic freedom in other countries. I think this is increasingly a global issue. So uh, I think this is the beginning of a new period in fighting censorship on the global stage. So I'm extremely pleased with this. On the one hand, I'm a pessimist. I think censorship has existed since when art has existed. Somebody has come up after the first artist created something and wanted it taken down. So I don't think it's going to disappear anytime soon. At least the impulse to censor will not disappear anytime soon. I think what is really important is to build a community resisting it. I think we have to be there every time to work for free speech, to counter the impulse to censor. And we cannot, we don't, we can't exist on the belief that this is going to end sometime. We have to know that this is a long-term battle and we have to be there to fight it. The most dangerous thing is silence. When there's no conflict, when nobody's put in jail, it means that uh, the human spirit is dead.